what it do, what it do, what it do, what it do. Uh, sad bail, FPV here coming at you from the workbench uh, with a heavy heart. And I know you probably have two primary questions on your mind right now, and that is Mad Bail FPV, why are you so sad? And number two, Mad Bail FPV, what's with that footage I just saw in the beginning? Well, that footage came from my buddy's Walker, my buddy Walker's camera. Uh, he was at the Bandos with me, and we were flying, and uh, that is actually the last known sighting of my OG uh, chameleon with the Velvet Motors. And basically, I took I took it out to the Bandos normal day, uh, flying with Walker, and we were gonna get some uh, some follow footage, and basically. I got real excited about it. I don't do follow footage a lot. I don't fly with people a lot. Uh, it's really cool though. And so I didn't turn on my DVR. <laughs> so I don't have any DVR recordings. And I, while we were there flying, basically what happened was is I put my quad behind his and I was going to follow him. And uh, he took off and he did his thing. And at one point, like right before we took off, I kind of saw a flicker of his... Um, OSD in my goggles, but I didn't think anything of it. Uh, bad idea. That's happened to me several times in FPV where I'm like, <laughs> oh, this is a bit weird. Ah, I probably won't think about it. If something's a bit weird or a bit off, always check it out. Always. <laughs> so basically, we start flying. I'm following him. Everything's good. And then at one point, I'm like pretty far away and he gets really close to us. And so when he gets close I kinda lose video and so I kinda pu I punch out really stupidly to try to avoid the interference when of course the interference is close to my body not my quad so me moving the quad isn't gonna do anything but I punched out and I was really high and I just completely lost video and I could tell that it was trying to get the video back it was like fighting for it for a good five seconds while I was still controlling it before it went you know completely fuzzy and I lost all telemetry, but basically it went down <clears throat> right near a river and creeks and stuff and it's just, it could it could be anywhere really, I mean it's like a needle in the haystack, uh, even trying to find the general area, I've reviewed that footage of my quad over and over again, I've been out there for three days looking, uh, I've been scouring the woods, I've been trolling the bottom of the creek bed with this plastic rake I bought, assuming that it, you know, went in the creek. But yeah, I've been out there for three days trying non-stop, and really the, the most devastating part of it, I mean, I know it's very devastating to lose a quad, uh, especially like your first real quad, but the GoPro, man, uh, I took my GoPro with it. So I uh, I don't have a GoPro right now. So, because of not having a GoPro and between searching for this quad and school, uh, I haven't been doing a lot of flying, haven't been making a lot of videos. I haven't really been motivated to make videos uh, the past couple days with all this going on. But honestly, today, uh, my friend Andrew Mata saved me and he loaned me $80 so I could buy a new GoPro on Craigslist. So, I'm actually going to go meet a girl uh, named Ava about 35 minutes away from here uh, pretty soon to see if, you know, she'll just sell me her GoPro for a very reasonable $80. So, looking forward to that. Anyway, I am, uh, I'm not gonna bring this camera with me. I don't imagine there to be any vloggishness <coughs> going on on my trip up to Illa or Carnesville or wherever. But, uh, if something does happen, I guess I'll take it on a GoPro. But either way, uh, if something cool happens after this, you'll know I got into something mildly interesting. Uh, if we just cut after this to flight footage, you'll know that I got the GoPro and everything went well, but nothing too interesting happened. Anyway, thanks so much for the watch, and uh, we'll cut out to the flight footage, the field, whatever, right about now. Testing. <clears throat> One, two, testing. I just got the new GoPro. Looks to be in pretty good shape. Dude said he never used it. I believe him. It was still in the box, but... Looks like we got a bit of uh, a bit of fire action. What's going on here with the fire? Better go check something out real quick. Damn, it's billowing. So I'm thinking the fire might be real, not just like some tire fire or something.
seems to be happening where they recycle aluminum cans. We got some coppage. Oh, 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 big fire over there, boy. They are burning some scraps. Oh, you see that? You see that ish? Is that a purposeful? Is that a purposeful scrap burning or is that judging by the fire truck it appears to be an accidental scrap burning? It's still so sketchy. That is like so noticeable. Anyway, on my way to pick up this GoPro, I uh, I saw a dank little church over with like some really nice spaced out pine trees. So let's go check that out and see what it has to offer. All right, here at the church, we're about to test. I uh, I got my new build back, the one I tried the Kalman filters on and ended up downgrading. Uh, then I broke the bottom plate, and so I couldn't fly it for a while. And now I've I've been flying my stock chameleon, the one that I rivered, and it flew so well that I decided to downgrade this one to the same firmware 3.2.0 that the other one my original chameleon was on and about the same pids so i'm hoping that this one is going to fly just as well as that one i got from armitan but i guess we are about to find out all right everything seems good to go oh yeah also uh, one of the reasons I suspect that my video went out back when I lost my original chameleon is because I think that I couldn't really figure it out uh, because I was getting bad interference kind of at other places. So what I've done is I've realized my omnidirectional antenna on my goggles. Uh, my patch, I recently switched to the triple feed. I haven't been having really many issues with that. But I realized my omni, which was an Omway one, the blue one, uh, that one is super old like i've had it since i got my first quad my wizard so like seven or eight months and i'm thinking that that one just might be done i mean they run out right they have like mating cycles or something a, a certain amount i don't know but in either case i'm trying a new antenna omni on my goggles now pagoda this guy so hopefully that'll fix the problem anyway time to test Just another day grinding up stone Till they turn into dust It's tough times in the rough Diamonds ain't enough to cover up A corrupted and fucked up Legacy of strange fruit Bloody whips and smallpox Trigger happy cops Barbed wire and fire water Y'all it don't stop When the colonizer came With the cross and the sword I do the first spear and said I declare war I'm a battle scar wearing their apparent Descendant of a long lineage Of proletarian and peasant So check the work ethic in the name the lessons might change, but the essence of the message is the same So when they say anything, say why is it? Class is in session till the teacher gets a big slip I ride the rhythm and buy the little wine Talk head, get the concrete to line with your spine I speak to find peace, but it's war all the time It's deep like the drive from rent and the shoreline I'm a more mindful guy ever since Finding out that I'm about to be your father And doubt is not an option And now I can't be getting crunk to fade it as often so get your hands dirty, cause a prayer ain't enough Boss, what cross? We got crucified by buckshot One million Jesuses and Judas got his nuts off pages Torn out the memory of those who remain Shackled with the chains of international capital gain They claim civilized with the animal ways Peace to Oakland, I've never been a fan of the A. But some days you can find me inscribing my soul on the page Every crime has an alibi Disciplined and organized is how I handle mine Jacks are spending mad time on they battle rhymes I can't knock it if you find it entertaining I rep those whose labor ain't compensated So check the work ethic in the name The lessons might change but the essence of the message is the same So when they say 
anything Say why is it? Class is in session till the teacher gets a pink slip 40 to a class, no wonder we delinquent Half the school district never make it to commencement I bend the spine of the track until it snaps Pops working overtime and he got a broken back Got three little sisters, one brother in the rack And mom prays Nevenas to keep the fam intact But this song ain't a song waiting for God to answer Brothers call me dog, they got the letters backwards I'm back with a plan of attack to repossess my name face in history, y'all Who wants test my capacity to spit caliber shit into a rhythmic lesson And entertainment's a legitimate weapon Igniting the cypher sessions, I'm deciphering life And blending both theory into practice, I write vernacular and actual fact, got no posturing A thousand points and fingers, I defied every one of them I ride for my brethren who carry the burden Of a future uncertain till the fall of the curtain You better move Hold your head high, soldier, it ain't over yet That's why we call it a struggle You're supposed to sweat Check the work ethic in the name The lessons might change, but the essence of the message is the same So when they say anything, say why is it? Class is in session till the teacher gets a pink slip Crazy landlady Try to switch up on the lease If she raises up the rent again It's time to say peace Peace, peace, and that's my peace It's still all about the bullet in the belly of the beast From the east, my brother, we came The lessons might change But the essence of the message is the same So when they say anything, say why is it? Class is in session till the teacher gets a big slip So keep marching till your feet split Open, no rest for the weary blue scholars Keep going day in a beautiful session. I am in a much better mood now since uh, losing that last chameleon. So wow, I, uh, I'm sorry, I must apologize to Quadzilla, Jake, and uh, everyone else in the comments on that other video about the Kalman filters who told me that I should downgrade a couple firmware versions. Now I agree with you. Of course, my stubborn ass had to take the long way around to find it out, but I'm here now and I'm loving it. Man, I, I feel like I've truly unlocked my build, so Hopefully there will be a lot more dope footage coming your way. Thanks for watching. Peace. So when they say anything, say why is it? Class is in session till the teacher gets a big slip. So keep marching till your feet split. Open no rest for the weary blue scholars. Keep going.